Oh my gosh, y'all, I could not wait. I have to show you guys the farmhouse finds that I found at Dollar Tree. If that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. Okay, y'all, I know that it's Monday and I usually have a DIY video coming out, but whew, my life is absolute insanity and I have been trying to get my stuff out to my she shed. If you didn't know, if you're new, I have a crafting she shed. I also have my little buddy over here. He's three months old, if you're new, um, and mama's got to do what she's got to do but i have been trying to get out to my she shed get all my stuff out of the house and back to the she shed for a while i had moved my stuff back in here for a little bit you know while my baby was getting a little bit bigger i just didn't want to bring a newborn out to my she shed in the dead of winter even though it's insulated um but i've been trying to do that i just can't find the time. Um, I've been trying to go to bed earlier, which I used to craft way late into the night. And I'm just trying to find a balance here. Um, but I really wanted to DIY with these items and I wanted to show them to you before I DIY with them. So that is why we are here doing a haul today. So if that sounds interesting, let's hop into it. Now I did find a few more new Valentine's Day items. Um, so I'll just run through those really fast. That way we can get those out of the way and get to the good stuff. Okay, so for the first Valentine's Day item that I finally found, which I wish I had found this when I did my video last week, the Valentine's Day video, because this Valentine's Day truck would have been perfect for that DIY, but that is okay. Better late than never. So I don't really know. This is called a wreath rail. I don't really know like what that's for. If somebody knows, let me know down in the comments. I was thinking like maybe hang a towel over it or something. I don't really know what a wreath rail is. However, um, I, I should have picked up a few. Uh, I, I'm trying to be a good girl, y'all. I don't need any more Dollar Tree stuff. But this stuff was like, I have to have it. Like, I don't even care. I have to. <laughs> Anybody else feel that way? Like, it's like FOMO, you know, like fear of missing out. Like, I'm like, shit, everybody else is getting this stuff. Like, I need it too, right? Anyway. So I picked up one of those wreath rails. These were super interesting. I absolutely love them. Um, now they're pretty much the same thing, just different colors and different patterns. You know Dollar Tree is like really paying attention. I say that every haul because they are. Um, but these have the little lips and it's shaped like a house. I thought that was so cute. So one light pink, then they also had the white pattern that has the double hearts cut out. Same idea, house, super, super cute. And then last but not least on the little house signs, they had these, or they have <laughs> the heart cut out um, little house. Super, super cute. Red. I absolutely love it. I think it's super cute. Let me know what, which is your favorite pattern. The next Valentine's Day item I picked up was this little plate. I, I feel like this is like a trinket tray. If you're into ASMR. Isn't it pretty? But I also picked up this. And you can probably see where I'm going with this. I'm going to make like, I don't know. I'm probably going to do, I don't know. I don't know, y'all. I'm so indecisive. I don't know if I should do another Valentine's Day video. Uh, I don't know. Indecisiveness is my worst trait. Anybody else super indecisive because your girl is. Okay, this is the last Valentine's Day item I picked up. And I picked this up for my girl because, um, you know, they do the Valentine's Day kits at school. And, um, last year we paid, I think like $6 for one of these little mailbox things at Walmart. So I saw that for $1.25 and I was like, hell yeah, that's a steal. Grab that girlfriend. Cause my girl went with me and I am DIYing her Valentine's this year. Hold on. I'll show y'all what I'm doing. Okay. So if you're new, um, 
I love chalk couture and on my website you can pick up these chalk made Valentine for you kits and I thought that it would be really fun for me and my daughter to do this together. So basically it comes with the bags, the staples, and then this goes at the top of the bags. And then you get like the little, um, there's several different patterns. Like it has a transfer with a bunch of different like sayings. So one is popping through with a Valentine for you. You're officially awesome. Have a ball on Valentine's Day. I'm a sucker for you. Have a colorful Valentine's Day, blah, blah, blah. So it has all these little things and then you can do like crayons. You can do balls. So we picked up party sticks because um my heart is a glow for you so we would put like a few little glow sticks in there there's balls there's suckers um what was uh play-doh mini play-doh so i thought that was that would be really really fun for me and her to do like i said so i picked up this for valentine's day at her school to do all that together um <laughs> I feel that that was just like li a little bit too dark. Even though my room is pretty well lit, I felt like it still needed a little bit of like light. But anyway, that is it for the Valentine's Day stuff. Now we're going to move on to the good stuff. So immediately when I walked in, I was pretty disappointed because I didn't see the stuff. I had seen everybody hauling it, but like I really had to search for mine because it was on an end cap. So, when I finally found it, I immediately saw these. Look how cute they are. Little, um, they call it deco decor, but these are like little tags with the beads. And again, I'm trying to be a good girl, so I only picked up one of each color. At my store, they only had the natural wood and the black, so I'm not sure if they have the white color. Um, but I have a feeling that they do. I just didn't see it. So I picked up one of each, like I said. These I'm really, really excited for. Look, I found them. This is what I really was looking for because I'm trying to decorate above all my kitchen cabinets. And I thought that these would be like perfect for that. Maybe chalk on them. I don't know. I don't know, but... They had the chicken, they had the piggy, and they also had the cow. Super excited for those. So I only picked up one of each of those. I probably should have picked up multiple just because, um, you know, you could put them all around above the cabinets, but only picked up one for now again I'm trying I'm trying so hard to be a good girl it's so hard when they're getting such amazing items like that's why I keep saying Dollar Tree's paying attention to us but anyway um the next item I picked up was just this like little sign it's that MDF and it's pretty heavy um I'm actually impressed like even though it's not real wood, what do you expect for $1.25? But as far as like the weight, um, it'd be really nice like sitting on a shelf or whatever. Again, chalk comes to mind or you can use your Cricut or if you're really good at hand lettering, um, I personally am not. But if you're good at hand lettering, you can totally write something on there. Um, so many possibilities. So I picked up one of those. Bless you, buddy. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you, bud. Next, I picked up this craft fabric. And I guess they're like strips. Yeah, strips. Now, I do have all three of these patterns. The farmhouse, butcher house thing this i've hauled these before but i thought that that was like pretty convenient to have them in strips you could make a garland out of that um many 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 different um ideas so the next item i picked up 
is this little house. Now, y'all know Dollar Tree is doing lots of different things with house shapes. Um, they obviously know that we love them. But this is a little bit different. So, it is that MDF. And then it has this frame around it. And then the background is like a chalkboard. So, I thought that was super interesting. It's got the little chimney at the top. Super cute. So, I picked up one of those. I also picked up these signs. So, this is like an easel. And it does have a ledge. Um, so, you could put something on. I mean, the ledge isn't very big. So, you could like expand that ledge if you wanted to. Um, but... I see many possibilities with this. It's that fake natural wood. Um, it's pretty good size. And I love the fact that it has the easel. So again, up on top of my counter or uh, cabinets, I could, you know, sit that up there, chalk on it, whatever the case may be. So I picked up one natural wood and I also picked up one white. You can hear my little Izzy in there. We're all like under the weather. Ugh, never ends, y'all. Never freaking ends. Okay, I really love these too. Now, I told y'all they are, they are coming out with all kinds of different house shape things. Look at these little signs, y'all. Again, these are really good size, like bigger than my head. It's that faux wood grain. Like, look how freaking good that is. Like, come on. And it's really like, I don't know if you can see it, but if you run your finger across, you can feel the faux grain. So I thought that was really, really cool. So I picked up two white ones of those. I also picked up a brown to maybe do like my own dry brushing over that. And then I also picked up two black ones as well. What do y'all think? What do y'all think? And if y'all want any ketone information on how I lost 60 pounds in six months, y'all know if you've been around, like, I probably would have never, ever showed up like this. But I've been cleaning, I'm, like, sweating, and I'm, like, shoot, I need to do that haul. So, I was, like, you know what? I feel good. So, what? I, I need to be me this year. I am being me no matter what. And I'm, like, you know what? I feel great. I'm confident in myself and I'm just really, really grateful for this product that has done so much for my life. I actually turned it into a business because I saw that it was helping so many of you. And I would love to help you on your weight loss journey or if you just need more energy, better focus, better moods. Um, this product was actually formulated for the brain. So if you don't need to lose weight, this product is still for you. As long as you're getting your calories in, you're not going to lose weight. Or if y'all want to uh, make as much money as you want to make, um, text my number, the word biz. Or if you just want ketone information, like I said, text me the word ketones. I got y'all. So moving on is this little sign with the bead hanger. Again, with that faux wood slat. You talking to the people, bud? He's talking to the peoples. So I picked up one black. Now they also have different shapes. So this one is a square and I picked up the white one. Beautiful with the frame around it. Dollar Tree is really stepping it up. I am like super duper impressed for just a quarter increase, like how much better quality items we're seeing. Yes, like I am all 
freaking for it. I don't know about you guys, but I am not complaining about the quarter increase at all. So next is the circle sign and it's the natural wood again with the faux wood slats. I just think there's, it's just so impressive to me. It's just so impressive to me. I don't know. Let, let me know y'all, but I, I'm like, yes, Dollar Tree, please give us more items like this. Y'all are doing the damn thing for real. Okay, so we just have two more signs and they're doing longer signs. Love, love, love that. Now, I didn't see any other colors with the slats. Um, I'm sure that they have different colors, but at my store, I only saw the brown, so I did pick up one of those. Now, I will definitely probably paint that. And then along the lines of the long signs, now I picked up, well, my friend actually picked me up one just like this, but it said, welcome. Hold on, let me grab it. Okay, so my best friend picked this one up for me. And I'm glad she did because my store did not have the ones with the wood word on it. So I had her pick me up one of those. Thank you, Jenny. You're the best. I love you. Um, always looking out for me. Y'all are always looking out for me. Like I have so many of you that message me like, girl, have you seen this? Do you want me to send it to you? And I just don't think you guys realize like how grateful and appreciative I am to have this community. Like y'all, we freaking hit 90K. Like, oh my God. And I cannot believe that I actually got there myself with everything I've been through in life. Um, I'm a recovering heroin addict. I am eight years clean. In April will be nine years clean. And I literally never ever thought that I could do anything. I never thought people would like me, let alone almost 300,000 people across all my platforms who follow me and subscribe to me and are interested in what I'm doing. It, it just, I wake up every day like I'm in a dream and I just want you guys to know how grateful and appreciative I am of literally every single one of you. We're so close to 100K, y'all. So don't forget, share this out. That's how I grow. But anyway, I'm just so grateful for y'all. And I just wanted to mention that. So this is from my friend. She sent me one of those. And I did pick up one of these without the wording from my store. Now, I thought these were really cool. Like, if you did not like these colors, you could totally, like, chain, you know, paint those colors or whatever. I personally like the way it is, as is. Um, but, yeah, possibilities are endless with that as well. The next item my best friend picked me up, which, again, I'm grateful for because I did not see these was this little home arrow sign. I thought that that was super cute with the arrows on it. Now, I don't use a lot of stuff like this just because like I would much rather transfer it on with my chalk couture, but I just loved that arrow. So I asked her to grab me one of those. Now she also picked me up this. I did see it at my store with all this farmhouse stuff. So I did not pick up another one just because I knew that I had one at home. But I love the fact that they're giving us blank stuff. Not with all the wording and all the like, here we grow or whatever the heck. You know what I'm saying? Like I appreciate plain Jane stuff like this. So that way we can customize it to our liking. So yeah. I have one of those, like I said, and then we're at the, we're down to the wire, y'all. We just have two more items to go. I love these. I absolutely love these mini mason jar, mini mason jars, y'all. Aren't they so stinking cute? Y'all know I'm a sucker for anything mini. Y'all already know. If you've been around for any amount of time, then you know I love anything mini. I'm just a sucker. I don't know why. Like, what is that? Like, what? why? 
why do we gravitate to like mini things? I don't know. Like I love watching the little mini houses, like doll houses, and they really take it seriously. Like they make mini food and they have like mini Christmas trees and mini presents and like all that stuff. And they literally use the stuff on the reels on Instagram or TikTok, wherever. They even have like little teeny baby bottles of like wine and like little bottles and cups of filled with Coke. And the stuff is real. They have like real ovens, real mini ovens. Like I, I can go down a rabbit hole for, I don't know, an hour watching this stuff. I don't know. It's crazy. Is, is that Am I weird or does anybody else like love miniature stuff? So anyway, I picked up two packs of those because I felt that two just was not enough. I, I don't know what I'll use them for, but <laughs> just to have in my stash, picked up two. All right, y'all. Now the last item that I picked up, look how stinking cute this is, is this, it's just called decor. Now it is a circle. It's got the buffalo check beads. Like, are you kidding me? And people got the nerve to complain about an extra quarter. Like, I just don't understand that. <laughs> I will pay an extra quarter all day long. Please, Dollar Tree, keep giving us stuff like this and this and this. Like, y'all, I'm so excited to DIY with this stuff. Let me know down in the comments what you guys want to see. Um. So, anyway, y'all. That was it for this haul. Oh, another thought was, if you didn't like it in a circle, you could always cut the tassel off and add another tassel. Or like I did with my Valentine's Day garland, I just glued a little decor piece to the end. So definitely, definitely um, lots of possibilities. So yeah, you guys, that was it for this haul. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for supporting me. None of this is possible without your support. And I just want y'all to know how much I love you. So if nobody has told you today, you are absolutely stunning. You're worthy. You are so gorgeous and you are so strong. You literally can do anything you set your mind to. Are you awake? Hi, baby. Come here. Say hi, friend. Look how big my Izzy is brother. getting. Yeah, we'll get brother. Hold on. So I got my littles here. This is how we do it these days. This is why it's so hard to get anything done because I'm just really enjoying like being a mom and soaking up these days because y'all they're just getting so big so fast. So with that being said, thank y'all so much for being here. I love y'all with all my heart and soul. If nobody has told you today, you are absolutely stunning. You are worthy. You are gorgeous. You literally can do anything you set your mind to. And with that being said, don't forget to text my number if y'all want any ketone or or business info, I would love to have you on my team. We literally teach you how to build up your socials, how to monetize your socials. Yes, it is a ketone business, but it is much, much more than that. And I would love to mentor y'all. My goal in 2023 is to help change others' lives. And yeah. I can do that through my ketone business. So that being said, don't forget to share this out. Subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll catch you in the next one. Say bye, friends. And he getting big, y'all. Oh, my God. Love y'all. Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload. Or join the DIY fam here to your right.